Hey guys, Ebomi here. This is going to be a video about the Knight Squared Tactical Professional Holster. I have been asked repeatedly in either comments on my original uh, video and in PMs uh, what my thoughts are on this holster. Well, as you can see, I mean, I literally took it off a moment ago so we could do this video. I carry my full-size all-steel Kimber 1911 Raptor. I carry this gun every single day. Basically, this holster is on my side whenever I'm awake. And I have to say that everybody that has asked me about this thing, this holster, hands down, is the most comfortable holster that I have ever used. And I realize that everybody gets uh, headstrong on their particular uh, holsters. I mean, I have uh, inside the waistband holsters, uh, outside holsters, the Serpra holster. Uh, this for, uh, you know, for a quite a long time was my uh, primary holster inside the waistband. Uh, some examples of really, uh, really awesome holsters is this one that uh, Shotgun Shanty custom made for me has the same uh, same same design in the holster as the uh, chain link design of my uh, 1911 uh, just as a footnote this would be what I'd call my barbecue gun holster when I want to show off the gun and show off this beautiful holster that's when I'll use this one as far as the Nates goes though I you know, anyone that's had an opportunity to try one of these will know exactly what I'm talking about. And those that haven't can only can only hear me when I say uh, you have no idea what you're missing. Uh, the one big thing that I would really like to point out is obviously when this holster is on me, everything that you can see right now is touching my skin. The holster the grip of the gun, all of that. In contrast, you can compare that with the Nates. When this is on my side, that's the only thing that touches me. My biggest regret is that when I started uh, carrying my, uh, my Kimber, I really wish that I would have known about uh, uh, Nate squared uh, holsters because uh, you know having having carried this gun on my side uh, I do have some uh, some wear in the bluing uh, pretty much everywhere where it makes contact with uh, with my skin uh, now now it doesn't touch me at all and people ask me uh, what what the comfort level on this is the comfort level is is beyond anything that I really thought it would be. A lot of people say that they couldn't carry a, a, a full-size 1911. This firearm disappears on my side in this holster. I mean, I could be uh, uh, laying on the couch, uh, watching TV, uh, sitting at a desk, uh, you know, moving around, sitting, getting in and out of a car, and I honestly, I do not notice the 1911. You know, when you actually have to reach down and go, oh, 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 whew. you know, it's still there, thank God. Uh, that is the, uh, for me, the sign of an incredible holster. It has the, uh, the soft, the soft uh, backing uh, to uh, make sure that it's not rough on your skin. It does have a subtle retention. I mean, we're not we're not talking about like a buckle on this thing, but in order to get it uh, out of the holster, you simply grab it and give it just a little bit of a twist. And for all you safety sallies, yes, this has been safety checked and it is loaded. And uh, people have asked me, does this holster is this holster doing uh, any damage, any damage to the gun? Well. In all honesty, let me see. Uh, 
I'd have to honestly say that there is there is no new marks. No new marks in the bluing anywhere from using it in this holster. Yes, I would expect that somewhere it would probably show... Uh, oh, here we go. Uh, well, never mind, I just wiped it off. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, I, I have not seen any new any new wear marks uh, to the uh, to the 1911. Well, it's been in this holster. You know, yes, I would expect it to. I mean, it's it's touching uh, it's touching the uh, the holster, but it's not uh, appearing on the gun. Not not anything like uh, the uh, wear marks from where it was touching my skin before. An absolutely, absolutely incredible holsters. Um, if I was going to critique uh, this holster at all, uh, the one thing that uh, you know that it that it does have is it has the single, the single clip, and I actually do uh, I do prefer that myself versus like the uh, the bigger uh, holsters with the uh, the dual clips. I do like the single single belt clip. Um, I have never, I have never drawn my, uh, I've never drawn the uh, gun out of the holster and pulled the whole thing with. It has a very, uh, a very nice clip. But I would say my one, my one issue that I would say about this holster is it, the clip is riveted in place. And what they designed it to do is when you put it on your belt, you can then tilt the holster into the cant of the angle that you want. And the the back of the holster basically hangs on to your skin. I have had a few circumstances where it does move around a little bit on me, but for the most part, the holster always holds in place against my uh, my skin. So, you know, the one thing I guess that I would uh, that I would say is a is a low point is that that has that has a rivet right there and you can't like just set the holster and uh, you know get it get it into a position that you want and then you know have a screw that you could tighten up and just leave it wait a second what is this oh look the new Nate squared tactical professional holster same backing material, same uh, neoprene front, and now it has a screw on the belt clip. So you can now uh, set it where you want it to go. For me, about right there Nate Nate um, I personally believe that by uh, putting that screw there you have taken an awesome holster and made a perfect holster I just wanted to show you guys that I was uh, I was meaning to do a uh, an update an update on uh, and answer all the questions that everybody's been asking me about this and uh, and then I got this and that's why I kind of wanted to wait uh, wait until it came so I could show you guys anybody that's tried this holster already knows what I'm talking about you're not gonna find a more comfortable holster they uh, they <laughs> They are absolutely incredible. And they hold up extremely well. I mean, like I said, I literally just took this off to do this video. It has some uh, uh, impressions uh, from, uh, from the 1911. And uh, the back. Back has a little sign of wear, but you know why wouldn't it? Uh, I don't mean to be gross, but the, this is up against my body, uh, no matter uh, summertime, wintertime. But this guy's is their uh, new Nate Squared 
uh, tactical professional series, and they uh, they added they added the retention uh, ability, so you can uh, set this into the cant that uh, you prefer on you without. Uh, without any concern that the uh, the holster or the weight of your firearm is going to move it around uh, on you. And like I said, I personally believe this takes an awesome holster and turns it into the perfect holster. Any of you guys that know me, I, uh, I wouldn't stand here and, uh, and make a video talking about something if uh, I didn't truly uh, believe in it and, and endorse what it is. Uh, these these are uh, hands down have been uh, uh, just insanely comfortable holsters. When when you can forget that you are carrying a steel a steel framed full sized five inch 1911 on your side and you have to double check to make sure it's there, I believe that the holster company has a uh, accomplished uh, quite a goal. And like I said, the comfort level uh, I'm. I've never been pinched by the gun. Uh, it's not an issue in the car with the seat belt. It uh, keeps it uh, extremely tight up against your body, and they have. Uh, it has just been a truly uh, fantastic uh, product to uh, use and enjoy. And uh, by doing that, they have uh, they have really uh, really changed things. I mean, this was good. I mean. I didn't like uh, drill out the rivet and put a screw in there and change it myself. Uh, it it stayed in place for me, but uh, this was the one the one thing that I would have done if I uh, if I owned the zoo, and uh, and uh, Nate and Nate, uh, they did it. So, uh, hats off to you guys for. Uh, uh, taking the feedback from uh, your customers and uh, implementing it very, very rapidly into production and getting that out. That is, uh, they are, they're fantastic. So if you have any other questions, I am, uh, I'm going to be upgrading and switching to this guy right here. So, um, I'll put, a uh, I'll put, uh, links, uh, uh, to uh, Nate Squared Tactical in the in the description, um, uh, really a great a great bunch of people. Uh, if you have any questions or concerns, uh, they are on top of it uh, right now. So, thank you, Nate. Nate, uh, that's awesome. That's that's right there. That's, that's perfect as far as I'm concerned. Incredible holsters. Please, please go check them out. Give them a try. Keep on me. Out of here. Come on.